Hey guys, welcome back to another tool review video. Today I'm going to show you the Genius Boost Jump Starter by Noco. Now this is one tool I'm happy to show you guys because it's handy all around the home, the shop, and also for your portable devices. And this is all the items that come with the Jump Starter in the box. You'll get the booster cables to boost cars. You're going to get also the cord to charge it up. Also the adapter to plug into your car lighter to charge up the unit. And you'll get these important booklets here that show how to use it. And I'm going to show it to you here up close. It's nice and compact. It's small. It actually fits in the glove box of your car. And it's got quite a few safety features, which I'll be showing you later on. It also has a built-in flashlight. I'm just going to show that to you right now. And to activate the flashlight, you just push this button here. And there's different features of the flashlight. If you push the button again, it's going to blink. So that's a feature that'd be handy in your car if you're broke down at night or if you're changing a tire. I also keep this in the house sometimes to use as a flashlight if the power goes off. Here's some of the specs on the back of the unit. It also gives you a lot of specs right on the box. It says that it will boost an engine up to a 6 liter. So you could actually boost a pickup truck with this thing. And you can do that for about 20 times. Now you'll get the booster cables as I've shown previously. They plug right into the unit. All you do is pop this cap and just plug it in there. I've actually used it a few times to boost the battery in my car when it was going bad, but I mostly use this around the shop to boost lawn tractors and different equipment with small batteries. And in the next clip, you'll see me boost an older lawn tractor that's been sitting with a dead battery for many months. And here's a perfect example of where this little booster would be used for my line of work. As you can see, the terminals are bad. The battery's very old. It's actually been in there since 07. And if I turn the key, there's absolutely nothing. Now I'm going to hook up the NOCO Boost. Turn it on. Push the brake pedal here again. And turn the key. And you can do it over and over again. And I'll do it a third time. Now a good guess is that I could boost a tractor like this for about 30 times with the Genius Boost. So as you saw, it's pretty easy to use to boost lawn tractor batteries. I find it handy because it's so small and portable. Now I'll just show you the adapter that came with it. You plug this in your car lighter to get power to charge the unit. And basically this is a USB cable. You just plug it in, plug it into your lighter, and then plug this end here in the jump starter, which will be right here. So that's one way to charge it on the go. Now if you want to charge it and you're at home, you just simply unplug it from the adapter. And you can plug it into any USB port on the computer to charge it up at home. And once it's charging, this is what you're going to see on it. At this point here, it's pretty well 100% charged. Now another neat feature is that you can use the charger for your smartphone to charge it up. And that's because the end of my smartphone charger fits right into the battery jumper. And then you just plug it into the same spot that you plug the USB cable to your computer. And that's it. But this way here, it's a bit handy because you can just plug it into the wall. Now another handy feature of the jump starter is that you can charge your smartphone using it. All you have to do is plug the cord into your phone. And then all you have to do is plug it into the USB port of the jump starter. It's that easy. And now my phone's going to be charging up. This is really handy because we do get a lot of power outages here when there's storms. And when you have this around, you don't need to look for a plug. Another great thing about this jump starter is that there's a lot of built-in safety features into it. And I'll just show you the safety features. First of all, if you want to use it, you have to turn it on. I'm just going to let it cycle through till it's ready. Now one of the greatest safety features is that if you accidentally touch the negative and the positive together, nothing's going to happen. Absolutely nothing. With other battery boosters I have, if you did this, there'd be sparks everywhere. The unit could potentially explode and cause damage and burn wires. Now another great feature, which I think is the best feature of this little unit, is that if you connect the connectors on the wrong terminals of the battery, nothing's going to happen. And I'm going to show you that nothing's going to happen by connecting the positive on the negative and the negative on the positive of the battery. And this is all that happens. 
A small alert light comes on, but nothing explodes or nothing shorts out. This is really good for people who aren't sure how to use battery boosters because they can just swap the connectors. So now I'm going to swap connectors and you'll see the light will not come on. Basically now if I was boosting a lawnmower or a lawn tractor, it would be ready to go. And then when you're done with it, you just simply turn it off. I really like this thing. I've used it a lot in different circumstances, including boosting lawn tractors, my car, and charging my phone when the power went off. And by the way, guys, this unit costs just over $100 here in Canada. Also, there's a link to the NOCO website underneath today's video. Check it out. There's a lot of information on this handy jump starter. And by the way, I also did not get paid to do this review. Thanks for watching guys. Make sure to subscribe and you can see me in my next video. Have a great day.